Hello, this is Andreas Exahes and I'm here with Inga Halbert of Field at Anuga. Uh, Inga, could you please tell me about some of the new trends uh, in the field? Yes, of course. So, uh, what we see at the moment in the market are the trend to naturalness. So, I think this is one of the most important trend which we see in food and beverages. And um, this shows us, um, especially in terms of uh, flavors, natural flavors, natural colors, um, plant extracts, but also natural solutions uh, for sweetening systems, for instance. And um, this is what we see at the moment. Um, the next trend, what we see is a trend uh, to uh, convenience or I, I can also say a fusion trend. So we see different types of flavors switch from one category to another and create a new category or new flavor uh, combination in uh, food and beverages. So for instance, some uh, beer mixed drinks and beer, nice beer flavors switching from lemonade to the beer market um, but also for food um, for instance um, they are uh, switching dessert flavors to uh, candies or chewing gums and this is uh, quite nice to see this fusion of different flavors another trend we see um, is uh, to, to have more refreshing tastes like mint flavors in combination with fruit flavors and this is also some uh, something what we present here on the booth for beverages and also for confectionery um, for instance um, for beverages we have really nice combinations of iced tea with mint flavors or also cover soft with, with lemon taste and mint flavors, peppermint or spearmint flavors, which shows um, the possibility of different mint flavors um, in beverages. And uh, the same we can also show in uh, confectionery. We have nice um, tablets uh, with um, fruit and mint combinations, which gives a really refreshing kick to the consumer if he eats uh, something like this. Um, uh, candies or tablets. And could you please tell me a little bit more about your specific new products? Yes. Um, if we have a look to our portfolio of um, flavors, we introduce on this fair some nice uh, natural cherry flavors. And uh, this means there's a range of different cherries, for instance, sour cherry, sweet cherry, black cherry, or amarena cherry, to fit different preferences in different countries. So, for instance, amarena cherry is very important for the Central European market because this fits very well to, to the consumer here. Um, if you have a look to sour sherry, um, this is a more fruity, more juicy taste uh, which fits very well for the French market for instance.